Stephanie Tower. Never miss the Bitcoin beat. This is Coinbit Calls. We begin with emerging discussions among U.S. lawmakers on how to effectively provide financial support to Americans badly hit by the COVID-19 pandemic. The U.S. has recently announced a stimulus package worth $2 trillion. Sending checks in the mail to taxpayers to get relief takes too long. So the U.S. House and Senate are learning more about new technologies that could potentially replace the legacy payment system. One of their proposals is to use blockchain and to create a digital dollar. The U.S. government is also studying to create its own central bank digital currency or CBDC. Are stimulus payments and a digital dollar ready for prime time? Well, currently, digital dollar does not translate into using a distributed blockchain technology like Bitcoin. Most likely, it is going to be a private centralized digital ledger maintained by the U.S. Federal Reserve Bank. But if the U.S. government pushes through, the hope is for them to tokenize their CBDC on top of the Bitcoin SV blockchain. Bitcoin SV is the only public blockchain that has the technological capabilities to scale at the level and CBDC requires. BSV has already solved complex issues of scalability, auditability, cost, and efficiency. More blockchain stories. This time, the Bitcoin technology is disrupting one of the fastest growing industry within the global food sector. Supply chain management application Seafood Chain is now being tested in the market. Built by Unisot and powered by Bitcoin SV, Seafood Chain provides solutions to industries like seafood and aquaculture to record and display insights into the complete supply chain. This enhances traceability and visibility, which are challenges within the industry. It also enables supply chain partners and end customers to make choices based on verifiable facts. While tech giants like IBM have recently entered the seafood industry, co-founder Stefan Nilsson believes that Unisot has a significant edge. That's an application, an industry application that is running on top of our blockchain platform called Unisot. By using this universal source of truth that the Bitcoin SV blockchain is, we can get information from the supplier supplier and we can give information all the way to our customers customers and all the way to the end consumer. So our consumer app, their consumer can add if they are allergic or if they have any preferences, non-meat or stuff like that. Sometimes it doesn't say in the ingredients a list today, but with our system you actually get exact the, the content of that package that you are holding. As they say, a picture paints a thousand words, but this story proves a painting can be sold through Bitcoin SV for thousands of dollars. It looks like Twitch is the new haven for artists who are looking for a platform to sell their art. The painting was sold on the popular social networking platform built on the Bitcoin SV blockchain. Twitch users can earn from the engagement they get from their posts, or simply by being followed by other Twitch users. Recently, an artist hid his painting on Twitch, and users quickly notice it. The bidding started through Twitch's pay feature, and the painting was awarded to one of the users. This is the first artwork in recent history sold on the Bitcoin SV blockchain. It was sold for 20 BSV or about 3,000 US dollars. In other Twitch news, the platform has passed a historic milestone. Its users have now collectively earned over 50,000 US dollars. And before you go, we're inviting you to register to next week's Bitcoin SV DevCon, co-hosted by Bitcoin Association and Enchain. Bitcoin SV DevCon is a virtual conference for developers who are interested in learning and building on the Bitcoin SV blockchain. Check out the bsvdevcon.net to learn more about the latest developments straight from the leaders across the BSV ecosystem. And that's it for this week on Stephanie Tower. Never miss the Bitcoin Beat with CoinGeek Pulse. Some inventions are easy to understand. Others need a bit of explaining. We got cloud service as well. So what, what does having cloud service mean in this context? My job is to get to grips with blockchain and digital money with the help of the smartest minds in the business. If I can understand what they're telling me, then I'm sure you will too. Join Charles Miller for CoinGeek Conversations every week. Click for details and subscribe to the CoinGeek channel.